Hello and welcome to Beginner's Guide to Nmap and Zenmap. Now, if you never heard of these programs before, if you're completely new to ethical hacking, uh, penetration testing, uh, computer networking, don't worry. I'm going to take you step by step what this tool is, how to install it on various operating systems like Windows, Linux, OS X, and how to use it in uh, while you're running some of these scans. Nmap as you're going to learn in this course, is a really incredible tool. It's a free tool, it's pretty easy to use, and it's extraordinarily powerful. Uh, so powerful that most um, hacking tools uh, and uh, pen testing tools, networking tools, will leverage Nmap or Zenmap in some sort of way. So again, if if you're a beginner, if you have some experience, uh, this is going to be perfect for you because, again, we're going to walk through how to set up uh, the installation for Windows, Linux, Mac. Uh, we're going to set up a uh, virtual machine. So we're going to actually be installing a program called Metasploitable. That's going to be the server that we're going to be scanning against. And we're going to be going through and scan doing all sorts of scans. Uh, see if the IP is live, scanning a, uh, a range of net, uh, IPs. We're going to be scanning... Uh, from a text file. We're going to be scanning to see if the host is alive, what operating system is running, what services are running, and a lot more. And as always, with any course that I make, if you have any questions or problems, go ahead and email me. doesn't matter if you haven't started the course yet, if you're in the middle of the course, or even if you finished the course. Uh, go ahead and email me. I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. And generally, I, I'm pretty good about getting back to people uh, either that day or within a day or two. And it doesn't really matter if it's directly related to this. I've had people ask me uh, questions and advice for uh, different papers that they were writing on the subject matter that I was teaching on. So again, if you have questions, problems, feel free to email me. And again, I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. And I really look forward to teaching you all about Nmap and Zenmap. So I'll see you in the next video.